Hello friends, today we discuss how to create a login page in ASP.NET So let's start You firstly add a web page Fold.aspx And uh, we take a text box You simply write it and uh, another text box and uh, one buttons it's a btn login and it's a txt id txt pass and we need to create a it's our table admin login so firstly we need to create a store procedures SP login and uh, take uh, admin dash for ID and where care fifty and uh, password is and where care fifty and also take a uh, one output parameters is valid it's a bit type okay adds begin end and the set and the rate is valid it's equal to select count you can count uh, any columns like i column i count admin id admin underscore id from where admin id is equal to and uh, password equal to mm, it's a standard keyword so I encapsulate in, in under the square bracket and we execute it it's executed successfully then we create a connection string for that we go under the web config section it's here we write a connection string connection strings at name is equal to a give a meaningful name con and it's a connection string and it's a provider name dot 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 sql client now i add a connection string here then we go to 
डिजाइन पेज एंड वी चेंज द टेक्स्ट से लॉग इन एंड गो टू हियर एंड वी एड फर्स्टली वी नीड टू एड थ्री मोर नेम स्पेसेस क्लाइंट एंड एस पी एल कनेक्शन कॉम्पिगेशन मैनेजर डॉट कनेक्शन स्ट्रिंग इट्स नेम ए कॉन डॉट कनेक्शन स्ट्रिंग then write a year command we write the name of stop procedure it says sp login and their connection object it's a command type procedure and uh, give their parameters name dot it with value we copy it give their parameters name and we pass their value and uh, we create object for output parameter like ob login login dot parameter name is is valid is valid no problem ob login ob login dot uh, sql db type is equal to sql db type dot bit it's a bit type and uh, op login dot uh, direction is equal to parameter direction dot output okay then com dot parameter dot add we add it we login now we open a connection com dot execute non query and uh, we take uh, variables trace trace and uh, 
we convert to int dot to int thirty two and it's uh, ob login dot value then we create a and we check it if equal to one else then we write here a message we if we take any level and below I rename it LBL image and we change four color it's red then we go to LBL message dot at login Access pull and we write here a message uh, admin ID or password is wrong. So now all it's done. Now check it. We firstly show their ID and password. Select store from TVL admin login. admin admin one two three so now run this Now, if we write, if we enter wrong password, then admin ID or password is wrong. If we give their respected ID and password, like admin, admin123, then it's login successful. Then all it's done. If you have any question, please write in a comment box. I will reply you soon for more videos and latest update related to .NET Framework. Please subscribe my channel. Thanks. Thanks for watching.